everyone. I hope you all had a wonderful Christmas and a happy new year. I'm so excited to be with you today showing you one of my favorite hair tutorials, how to curl your hair with a curling iron. This has been one of my most requested videos and this is also my favorite look to achieve for that everyday look or for any special event that may come your way. I'm so excited and I hope you are too. Let's get started. Okay, so my hair is clean. I washed it last night. And basically what I did was I didn't blow out my hair when I dried it. I just used my fingertips and just kind of went like this to create some body. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but my hair isn't completely straight. It does have some wave in it. My hair is naturally wavy and has a lot of curl underneath here. Um, so if you are a person that has naturally curly hair, that is good news. Now, if you don't have naturally curly hair, no worries. I have seen this done on many people that have straight hair. Um, just a few tips that I would suggest doing is um, using some type of shampoo that is for curly hair or that helps with texture. Or if you don't have that, I would suggest using some type of mousse in your hair before you blow dry it that does create curl. Nothing too crunchy though, something that will allow it to stay soft and allow it to move and not be super stiff um, whenever you are blow drying it. Um, I do like to blow out the top of my hair so that it isn't super curly because if I don't do that I'm going to have a lot of frizz um, up here towards my roots and in my bangs and I don't really like that look so I like more of a soft curl so I will use my round brush and blow out the top of my hair but like I said at the ends I just use my fingertips while I'm drying it to create the texture that I need for this look. Okay, so I'm gonna start by separating my hair into different sections. So I'm gonna start with the bottom of my hair first. So I'm just gonna use my fingers and separate a section out to where I have just a little bit of hair on the bottom. And then I'm just gonna twist it up and use a clip that I have to clip it. Okay, hopefully that holds. Okay, so now I have about this much hair left on the bottom. Okay, so I'm going to start by explaining how to hold the curling iron. Um, the look that I'm going for today is more of that loose, um, wavy look for the curls. Um, so I want my curls to be going away from my face. So when I start, I like to start on my left side. That's just what I do. Um, so I'm gonna, when I'm holding the curling iron, my fingers, my fingers, uh, index finger and middle finger on the clamp and my thumb and hand are just around the base of it. So I'm just going to take about a couple inches thick of hair, just about that much hair, and I'm going to start by opening the clamp and the clamp is going to be on top. Okay, I don't know if y'all can see. So the clamp is on top of my hair and I'm just going to pretend like it's eating my hair like an alligator, I guess. <laughs> Um, if you want to be, use your imagination. Um, and so I'm going to clamp it down. I'm going to slide it almost to the end, not to the very end so it doesn't slide out. And I'm going to start rotating it away from my face and bring it as close to my scalp as, my, as I can. Um, and when I do get to a point where I can't get any closer um, so I don't burn myself, I'm just going to slightly tap the um, handle of the clamp and inch my way down to where I don't see any more hair hanging off and I know for sure now that I have all of my hair included into that clamp. Okay, so again just bring it close up, close as close as you can to your scalp and just hold it for um, I would say about 10 seconds. You want to make sure not to burn your hair. Um, when you do start seeing smoke, you want to let go. So I'm letting go and I'm just going to release the clamp and slowly bring it down and now I have this big, nice <laughs> ringlet of hair here. Okay, and I'm gonna continue doing this all the way up until the top layer of my hair, um, and then I will explain some more. Yes. 
inside out from the inside out Okay, so I've curled all of my hair except for the very top layer. I wanted to show you how to do this before I end this today. Um, so I did just get my hair cut and I do have a little bit of shorter layers than I had before. So this can be tricky. Okay, so I'm just going to take a little bit of hair like I did before. Um, and I'm just going to take the curling iron like I explained earlier. Same concept. We're going to bring it down. But I'm going to leave a little bit more out this time and just really hold it um, towards the top half of that strand of hair to really add volume um, before I go all the way down. Inch just a tiny bit down further, hold it, and slide it out. Okay, so you have this nice little curl right here. So I'm just going to go ahead and finish. Okay, so I just finished curling my top layer. I'm just gonna spray some hairspray. And for the last step, I'm just gonna use my fingertips and start combing through the curls. And while doing this, if they do start to, if you notice that they start to completely come out, you can retouch at any point. Um, but like I said, I'm going for more of that casual, um, wavy look. So I'm okay with the curls coming out. Okay, and so once you have combed through as much as you want, you can even feel free to dip your head upside down and shake it. Um, shake it out. I like to do that sometimes as well. Um, so I've combed my curls out with my uh, fingertips, and now I'm just going to spray some hairspray to finish it off. Spray those roots really good. And that is how to curl your hair with a curling iron. Thank you for watching today and stay tuned for another video coming soon. Bye guys.